we have just added multi-step checkout to all of the cart flows premium plans. It is so easy to convert your existing checkouts or to build new checkouts that are going to have this multi-step layout. Let me show you right here is our already beautiful modern checkout layout that our customers absolutely love, but we're going to convert this into a multi-step checkout. So everything's not being asked all at the same time. So that's my store checkout. So let's go ahead and edit it real quick. I'm going to go to where it says cart flows and then click right here where it says store checkout. Here is that store checkout. I'm going to go and click on edit. And then I'm going to edit the design. Now this design is done inside of Elementor. So it's going to take me into Elementor. Here is the checkout form that cart flows creates. I'm going to click on it and it reveals the options here on the left. It says select layout. I'm going to click to the display all the options. And we have an option right here that says multi-step checkout. I'll go ahead and click on that. And then I'm going to click on apply. And now let's go ahead and test it. So I'll do a fresh cart. Let's go ahead and add these two products right here to the cart. And I'm going to go to visit the checkout page. And you can see now we have the gorgeous multi-step checkout where your buyer is less likely to feel overwhelmed by all these things being asked of them. All right. So I've already filled out my customer details. I'll click on continue to shipping and you can see at any point your buyer can go back to a previous step. If they want, you can see it lists out that information and I can click on change here. If I wanted to go back and edit something in the prior step, let's go back to our shipping. Here's the shipping options for your buyer. They can choose whichever shipping method as well as the ship to a different address inside of this screen. So this works for me flat rate. I'll continue to payment. And as you can see now, the buyer can also go back and edit that address if they needed to by just clicking on the change option right there. And it also shows them the address that they've entered. And now I can choose a payment. But guess what I've also done here is I've added a one click order bump to this step. So when someone first visits my checkout form, they don't see that I'm going to be offering them an order bump just a little bit later in that checkout process. So if you have a cart flows plan that includes order bumps, you're going to get a ton of use out of adding your order bumps here to the payment screen. So I'll choose cash on delivery, which is fine. I'll click right here where it says buy now. And it's taking me, of course, to a one click upsell. I mean, this is cart flows after all. I'll just click on no thanks. I'll pass on this particular upsell. And here we are. That's all there is to it. And like I said a moment ago, that this is a feature available on all of our cart flows plans. This is just another way that cart flows helps e-commerce stores sell more. Thanks for watching this video. Give it a thumbs up. Subscribe for more updates like this. Thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.